If you close your mouth, you go down. Tomorrow, Cynthia, you're not a people. Everybody says, I'm spent. Fear, day and night, they will walk. I'll give you a time, baby. God, God, I'm going to go. Your Majesty, there are rumors making the rounds all over the town. Insinuations has it that somebody is claiming he is you. Another faction says some persons are exactly like you. So we cannot really fathom which is which. This is why we are here at least to present uh, what we may call an eyesore to you, my king. Yes. But they are lies. They are complete lies. A fat one from the pit of hell. They might look exactly like you, eh? but ooh, ooh. they are not you. Mm. I don't know what you're going through. I don't know how you feel. But what you did a few minutes ago got me really scared and worried. Have you ever been in a world where you are queen? You run your own empire. You have everything you want at your back and cup. And just like the trip of lights, you lose everything. You become a nobody. I used to think I am the queen in Nelson's world. My ex. But I was wrong. I understand how you feel. It's just a face. A face of hard times. I call it a face because someday it's going to fizzle away. I have nowhere to go. I have lost my way back home. My home, like heaven, has been taken away from me. My uncle has played the first one on me. He wants me dead. But I have my eyes on him. He must be very cruel. No. No, he's not. I am worse. I am worse than the devil himself. I... I just want you to take it easy on yourself, okay? I mean... Maybe life is giving you a second chance to make things right. To make things better, to amend your ways.
How was your night? My night was fine. Uh, at least I had a roof over my head. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> That's good to know. So, is there something I could help you with? Uh, okay. Uh, um, you could help me with the... Uh, help me put them in the freezer. You want me to put them in the freezer? Yes. Very well. I will help you do that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Apart from this, is there any other thing you want me to do for you? Nothing, just, just that. Just this? Very simple. <laughs> You know, it is you I love. I mean, I love you. Why are you acting shocked? Don't you want to be my queen? No, no. no. Oh, sorry, Your Majesty. Yes, I would love to be your queen. Yes. He said yes. <laughs> Majesty, please, you have to excuse me now, please. Well, he said yes. <laughs> you know this calls for celebration. Yes, Your Majesty. We need to celebrate this because you are going to be my queen. <laughs> it feels so good to be king. I am so happy to be king. You know, when you're king, you can wield powers anyhow you want. And right now, I'm exercising that right. <laughs> King, I am king. King got us great skin now. <laughs> I am king. <laughs>
You are my dog. Yes, I just see. I am your king. Yes, I see. Your maker. Your god. And you are my dog. Yes, your majesty. And I, King Otto, will use you as it pleases me. Now crawl. Crawl on your knees. Come to me. Lick my feet. That is what you are. A dog. Now the next time you forget to feed my cat, the next time you make my cat feel sick, the next time you make my cat meow in my ear, I will have your head. Get out! <laughs> I will so split your truth, King Otto. I will deal with you. The time has come for me to pay you back for all the evils you've, you've shown me and my family. I will never ever forgive you. Never. I will never forgive you. What is happening here? <sighs> Nothing. Nothing? Are you sure? I hope you're not planning anything funny against the king. You might not, you might not be spared, it seems to. We all have a scar of pain unleashed on us by the king. But be cautioned and be careful of what your thought is telling you. Many have gone. Cassie, I'm fine. So be it. The cleaner may be our queen. Yes, you heard me. I promise you she will leave. Okay? Oh, Speak no more. Your Majesty, I know you are a fine man and you have a blessed heart. The cleaner we go. Thank you, Your Majesty. Bless your heart. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I have not accomplished my mission in this place. Why would he ask me to leave and come back next week? Oh, gosh. That journalist. That bitch. That fool. Okay. I know what to do. I will go and return even stronger. I have to visit a great native doctor. I have to conquer. I will be the next queen. All my wish and prayer for you is to become the next queen of this great kingdom, my dear friend. <laughs> I mean, look at you. You look so beautiful. <laughs> Suddenly we are friends. Yes, I support you. Come on, food is ready. I'm coming. Nelson, I will not be fooled again. I will not be fooled. You can go to hell for all I care. What do you want? Why can't you leave me alone? I don't want to see you anywhere around me. Just go to hell. 
I want to focus on my business. Leave me alone, Nelson. Maureen. Maureen, you are mine. Not just mine, Maureen. You are my girlfriend. You are my bitch. You can't call off this relationship. I am the man here, and I'm supposed to call it off whenever I want. Now, listen to me. Follow me to my car. We need to talk. You're mad. I can see you're sick in the head. Oh, I'm your bitch, right? I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. My father and Kambili warned me, but I didn't listen. I don't blame you. You see, I don't like repeating myself. And for the last time, follow me to the car. We need to talk. <laughs> Why don't you drag me? No, drag me into the car that I contributed in buying for a heartless and a useless soul like you. Go on, drag me. Stop it! Hey, hey, stop it. Hey, stop it. Here, I swear to God, I will kill him. Hey, man. You will not kill anybody, okay? You will Please not kill Please leave him to beat him. Uh uh! Please. It's too much! Think I help you? I help you! Uh -uh. Why will he do that to you? Why will he drag you like that? Oh, huh? oh Gami, you too much. You defect so. You know, see how you, you, you beat Nelson, put them for ground, sharp, sharp. You know, waste time. Can't believe me. <laughs> no can believe me. This one sweet me die. You see, if I come back in, I go give you one bottle. <laughs> Make I go give my uncle for us. Just go. Just go. I am so sorry for what I did. I know I went too far. But I couldn't stand him dragging you like that. No man should drag a woman like that, especially when she's beautiful. It's okay. I understand your plight. But next time, Learn to defeat your short temper. Please. You should know how to manage people properly. You should treat them nicely, no matter what. Okay? Okay, I'll try. Do you love him? No. Not anymore. Look, Otto, allow me to teach you how to nurture people. You really scared me. You don't need to fight with everyone. Customers, anyone at all. Okay? Okay. What did I tell you to say when you offend someone? Sorry. Good. That should always be on your lips. Sorry. When you offend someone, I'm sorry. Okay? But the first lesson is smile. Yes, smile. Like this. <laughs> smile, that's good. So, I'm happy. I'm happy you're learning. And you've been able to win Camille's heart. She likes you now. Your Majesty, this is a reminder from the palace archive. We will be having dignitaries from all around the kingdom and by extension to federal ministers, state commissioners and traditional rulers 
converge to grace this occasion of our king's birthday coming up tomorrow. So we have come to rub mind with our king uh, to know what and what is expected of us to do by the king. Since we are so sure that this occasion of our king's birthday will attract a global attention. Yes. Oh! It is my birthday. Ah! <laughs> okay, Chuku! <laughs> Happy birthday to me in advance. <laughs> yes, Your Majesty. Your birthday. Yes, yes, it is my birthday. I am so happy my birthday is coming up very soon. <laughs> I want a lot of things for my birthday. Oh, my, Your Majesty, yes. you've forgotten that the Council of Elders has an obligation to carry out on your occasion of your birthday celebration. And that is why we've come to inform you. An obligation? Of course. Well, why don't you go ahead and continue the normal obligation for my birthday? Yes, that is the right thing to do. <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh, <laughs> my birthday. birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. <laughs> yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Quite excited about tomorrow. Excited? Why? Tomorrow is a special day, and I have ordered a special cake from one of the best pastries in town. A special cake? I love cakes. Oh, thank you very much. I really appreciate. Thank you. <laughs> You know, I honestly cannot wait for the pronouncement to be made tomorrow. The pronouncement? Yes. Oh, yes, yes, exactly. You will make the pronouncement. <laughs> That's I, interesting, you know. I, I, I love this game so much. This game, they are trying to challenge me. <laughs> your Majesty, you said for me. Yes, I do. I heard you are not feeling so fine. Yes, Your Majesty. That is too bad. Too bad. <sighs> My lord, this sender is just a servant. A maid. No, no, no. Isindu is not just a maid. She's a special person to me in this palace. Alright? Uh, Isindu. Yes, Your Majesty. I want you to take a day off. Thank you, Your Majesty. And take care of yourself. Thank you, Your Majesty. You like it? Yes, Your Majesty. You like it? If you are happy and you know, clap your hand. Very good, very, very good. You believe. 